Well, it's a, a song, there's many, many songs on yeah, yeah, you know, from all these amazing uh, uh, bands that yeah. did these songs. But this musical, um, we built this city. We built this city, that's, that's one of my favorites. I always think that Melbourne is that we built this city on rock and roll. Right? Yeah, true that, true that. Yeah. And uh, what's your advice for teenagers trying to break into the industry? Just believe in yourself. Believe in yourself. And don't let anyone. How are you, mate? <laughs> Here, here is the rock guru. Uh, I want to ask you a few questions in regards to 80s music and music in general, if that's okay. alright. Um, Sorry, am I going to get the questions right? What's your fondest memory? Or like uh, inspiration from the 80s, like what's? Uh, probably Wham, um, Culture Club, fluorescent socks, bubble skirts, <laughs> and rah rah skirts. That's a lot. I remember these. Yeah. So fashion played a big influence on you so. during the 80s. Yeah. Fashion Last question: um, If you had one thing to say to teenagers who want to get into the industry, what advice would you give them? Well, it's it's hard to get in, you know. Don't give up. You've got to keep yeah. on striving, no matter what. It's, yeah. it's just it's just tough. But if you love it, it'll happen. Thank you, Thank you so much. Thank you. Dr. Carl on Neighbours is here with us, also known as Alan. So. Um, What's your fondest memory of the 80s and why is that so? Oh, well, you see, now the thing is, I, didn't, I wasn't a big fan of 80s music, but yeah. the one song that for me will always live is White Snake, Here I Go Again. Oh, well, you'll be hearing White Snake in Rock yeah. of Ages. I mean, that's, uh, I Can you give us a couple of bars? Yeah. You know? Here I go again. <laughs> that is epic. I can't believe you just did that on camera for us. Thank you so much. That means What's a lot. What's your favourite 80s fashion piece? I think really for me it's all about hair. Hair? Yeah, I mean like the clothes were what they were, but hair, the hair, I always wanted to have, my friend Cameron McGlinchey is here drumming in the show and he's kind of got the hair you have yeah. to have. Right? Long, yeah, yeah, but it's got to have a curl. Yeah. Oh, it's okay. got to have curl, you know. Yeah, awesome. Wow. No, of course I didn't have, I didn't really have any hair. You know? <laughs> <laughs> Bit embarrassing. Oh, thank you so much for talking to me. It's a pleasure, guys. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, I'm just going to visit which is a, um, an online teen music show run by teens for teens. Very good. Now we're just wondering what you think of 80s music in general and how it has impacted on the music industry. I was born in the 80s, so I have to love 80s music. Yeah. And I don't know anything about this show really, but I heard that it's 80s music, so I thought it's great it's to come. It is really, really good, and we've got like um, Foreigner, White Snake. You can't go wrong. I know exactly. <laughs> now. Um, Speaking of the 80s, what's the most iconic thing that about the 80s for you? Leg warmers. Leg Not warmers. that I wore any. Oh. No. <laughs> but do you wear them now? No. Oh, that's a good question, actually. Now, yeah, I've um, got them on here. Yeah. <laughs> now, what's your advice for teenagers trying to break into the music industry? Oh, don't do it. Don't do it. No. <laughs> No, um, you know, obviously just stick to your guns and, you know, do what you love to do and hopefully people love you for that and hopefully, you know, you, you get through. So, thank you very much. Another question, sorry. Yeah. You've just done, you've done Wicked in, what, in 2009, 2008, somewhere there? Yeah. Are you thinking of doing more musicals like that? Or oh, if that the right role came along, but it's, it's definitely not something what I'm looking at doing right at this very moment, but yeah, if, if the right role came along, I'll definitely look at it. Yeah. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you. Everything about the 80s first off. Uh, I think it has to be the uh, the fluoro colours. Uh, <laughs> have to be the the eyeliner. Uh, the leopard print. <laughs> I, I don't it's sort of making a comeback now. Though, I was just thinking, yeah, exactly, it's not so much 80s. I don't know if, if you've seen any film clips these days. Yeah, yeah. Everything is now 80s. Yeah. But it's yeah, all coming back. It's a bit too much for me. I think I might have missed it. Uh, I was too young and now I feel like 
Yeah. 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 Really want to go there. Yes. Now speaking of fluoros, you actually had that, like, those purple sunnies. Now can you show us uh, and our viewers what your sunnies look like? Yeah, these are something I picked up from my mate. Uh, actually, she just lives across the road, so <laughs> <laughs> last minute little. I knew it was. Edition. How awesome are they, guys? Are they going to be a They're permanent awesome. addition to your outfits? Well, I think so. I mean, if we're coming to any more sort of uh, rock, 80s, 80s yeah. glam rock events, definitely this is what I'll be wearing. Yeah. yeah. And what's next for you? Uh, mate, some more auditions coming up. Yeah. Uh, for more TV and film and uh, musical theatre as well. Ah, awesome. We can't wait to see you back on the stage. And back Can the you screen. give any hints of the musical theatre you're going to be auditioning for? Uh, no, but, uh, I'm sure you know anyway. So. <laughs> I hope there's only a few shows coming out. Yeah. So. True that. <laughs> Favourite 80s song? Favourite 80s song, Here I Go Again, White Snake. Can we get a couple of bars? Here I go again on my own. Looking down the old road, I'll never know. Yeah. He's a legend, guys. He's an absolute legend. Absolute legend. Enjoy tonight. Thank you so much. I've been waiting for a girl like you by Foreigner. Oh really, can you sing us a few bars? I've it... been waiting for a girl like you to come into my life. And I believe it's in the show. Yes it is, so, it is. She's yeah. absolutely awesome, isn't she guys? Now, um, Amy, she's great. <laughs> now your favourite 80s artist? Collectively Journey. Yeah? Or Pat Benatar. True, that's they're, they're good. Pat yeah, they're good. They're good. Um, and what's your advice for teenagers trying to break into the industry? Keep doing it. Yeah. Keep gigging, get your stuff out there. Ignore what people say. If, if, if there's people that are saying, you can't do this, you can't do that, um, just do it. Gather funds, do it, release your own stuff, put it on the internet, just get it out there. Preach. She got Preach. it down. Iconic 80s fashion that you still wear today. Leg warmers, definitely. Yeah. Side ponytail and slouch jumpers. Yeah. Like the Olivia Newton John, John let's get yeah. physical kind minus of. Minus the lycra, minus the lycra. Minus the lycra and the really flat <laughs> sweaty Thank you so much. Not a problem. Have a good night, guys. Hey guys, now we're at the after party. So before you saw us at the red carpet for the actual show, and now we're down here at the, at the Plaza Ballroom for the after party for the Rock of Ages. You've seen the key first one, I'm Australia. We're going to interview some more people down here. Just for yeah. the Rock of Ages. Okay. What do you think of it? It's absolutely fantastic. Really? Loved it. Yeah. Loved it. Music, music. Music, incredible. Um, the dance, it was fantastic. It's one of the best nights I've had on the show. So you just came out of Rock of Ages. What do you think of the show? Oh, yeah. Yeah, and like even you being so young, you still enjoy the music. Yeah. And out of five stars, what would you rate it? Uh, thanks, man. So you just came out of Rock of Ages. What do you think of the show? It was really good. Oh, it was it rocking. It was rocking with the doing the pink one oh. stink kind of fucking <laughs> white. It was great. They didn't take themselves too seriously. It was funny. I oh, love that. Cool. Like, and I love that Stacy guy. Stacy, he's my oh. kind of man. Yeah, he's got it going on. He's got it. Yeah. He's got the no. hair no, it was a really good show and um, everybody concerned should be very proud of themselves and done a great job. Uh, thanks, man. Thank you very much.